show your mom and dad? Because they haven't ever seen it before. Oh. Do you like the bean game? Yes, I, I love it. Oh. Okay. Cool. Well, are you going to go up and show them? Yes. Okay. Can I see? The bean game reminds me that Katie and I got to have a Thursday night board game and desserts night and uh, that was really fun this past Thursday. We wish you could have been there, but I, best, I guess it would have been a long drive. Um, we're doing the board game night once or twice a month or something like that so that we can keep up with our friends. Board games are fun and they make people feel relaxed and they like hanging out with each other. Uh, but it's hard to have like super meaningful conversations about life while you're playing a board game with lots of people. So... Oh my god, oh my god. What? What? What's going on? Oh, I think Miss Katie is playing her cello and Xander's super excited. Um, so my question for you is, what context do you think are helpful for having meaningful conversations with people? Maybe conversations about their life, or their struggles, or fears, or spirituality, or uh, whatever. Uh, Katie and I are thinking we'll get coffee with some people, try and have better conversations, and keep doing the board game thing, because it's super fun. So, uh, I'd be interested in your thoughts. In other news, Katie and I just celebrated our second wedding anniversary by going to Oak Park, Illinois. We, well, before we went to Oak Park, we went to the mall and went bowling, which was kind of fun and impromptu, but then... We went to the Growl Mill in Oak Brook, which was a really cool museum in the DuPage County Forest Preserve that you should go to sometime. Uh, but then we went to Oak Park and went to the Frank Lloyd Wright Museum and uh, his home and, and, and shop from way back when he was an architect. And then we got to go to a play of To Kill a Mockingbird. And I wonder if you remember much about that story when you read it as a freshman in high school. Uh, and its relevance to conversations about race and social relations today in the United States. Love you, and I'll talk to you later.